expat. Hello, Earth Clan. No doubt you've just come back from the colonies. Yeah. Will you be needing supplies? Colonies. What colonies are you talking about? Oh, my mistake, Earth Clan. I assumed it doesn't matter. Pharos? Novaria? Well, if you haven't heard of them yet, I'm sure you will soon. But it doesn't matter where you hail from. My goods are available to all. What can you tell me about Novaria? The corporate capital of the Attican Traverse. Very cold. Very snowy. I don't get too many clients from there. They all You're going to wear a bit more tropical? I'm not really a cold weather fella. What about Pharos? I'd like to know more about Pharos. It's an old Prothean world. Their buildings still litter the surface. The humans aren't the first to colonize it, but they are the most recent. Hmm. I just realized I haven't heard from my contact on that planet for some time. Hmm? Ah, well, I'm sure he's fine. Doesn't really care much, does he? Uh, let's see what we got. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. 80,000. Dude, everything is so expensive. Ooh. Let's get another license. That's our second license. We scan that keeper, right? Yeah. So from here, we can go to the lower markets. The alleyways lead to the lower wards. But since we're already here... Is that really... Wow! It's you! There's a lot of fanboys. You're Commander Shepard. The hero of Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. Hello. Nice to meet you. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. They say a lot of things. I was too busy killing them to count. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Yeah, sure. Why not? He's going to use my signature to forge Anything something. for a fan. Here. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. I don't like that guy. I don't like that guy at all. Can I have my autograph back? The fan. What harm could there be in talking with him if I meet him again? Yeah. Yeah, what harm? There's a wall there. Did we need three more keepers? Chorban, that's who we've got to talk to. Morlan, you've all got silly names. Hello there, welcome to Morland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Yes. Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Yes. Standard items. Does this mean we missed buying a, a license from the floating brain thing? Because I don't think we clicked on regular items. We can, we can always go check. Two hundred increases. Do I have to in install this somewhere? Well, let's get the license before I forget, but let's get that and see what it does. Uh... Let's equip that. Uh, there's also the damage resistance. Damn, man. That thing is good compared to pretty much everything we have. We'll equip that. Do you? What is he missing? Grenades? Yes. Biotic amp. We'll keep what we've got. We 
What do we got? We've got Onyx 1. Can't use medium armor yet. We'll go up to medium armor at some point, but... Uh... Oh, it's the same, but it looks different, doesn't it? We may as well just keep that. Put it there, Torian. Duelist 2. Way better shields, but... Yeah, why not? Why not? Keep what we've got. Sniper rifle, that's for him. Bomb those two off. That Reaper's not bad. We'll keep that. The Kessler, we're going to bomb that off. We're going to bomb that one off. Shotguns. For Rex. Them. And I want this guy to have a assault rifle, so. Accuracy's pants, but it gets more damage. So, why not? Hell, he's, a, he's an NPC, and if the computer can't make him accurate, then that's, that's beyond my control. There we go. Hello there. Should have sold Hello all my Homeland's junk. Famous shop. You want many good... Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Does he... Sell. Sell all junk. Yes. Also, while we're here, let's Hello check there. out this uh, non-human armors. Oh. Oops. Um. Hello there. Welcome to more. I was spamming. You want... Oh, you will be. Quarian. We haven't got a quarian yet. That's who we have to uh, try and rescue. Dude's got some bodyguards, man. Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? Yeah. You can start by telling me the truth, Shorvan. Yeah. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are... We're not buying it. Jaleed told us you've been after it. You spoke with Jaleed? Then you know about the data? No, but you're gonna tell me. Everything. You boys can go. Looks like my plans have changed. It's not as bad as you think, Commander. Jaleed and I just got a little... over our heads. Keep talking. The company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jaleed and I saw even more potential, so we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the Keepers. Can you imagine? A tool that can actually get readings from the Keepers? So? What's so special about that? The Keepers are almost impossible to scan. And you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. They blow up. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. The lead's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. I should kill both of you idiots. We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. So they're both lying to us. If you'll just continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. And you'll stand to make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? I suppose a little scanning here and there won't hurt anyone? Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jaleed. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jaleed won't help me analyze it. If I have time, I'll talk. Yeah. Uh, Thank you. And where was he? He was in CSEC, Quani. So we can, we can go back there. I don't know, man. I, I don't know. Too late now. They're scanning keepers. Not that there are any. We haven't seen one for a little while. How many more do we have? Um. Three, we got three more to scan. Okay, where are we? Alleyway. There was a keeper in here, but I think we've scanned him. Yeah. 
And we've been to the markets. Upper markets, lower markets. Cora's palace? Cora's, uh, yeah. Cora's dead, not Cora's palace. Makes him sound like a hut. Christ! <laughs> yeah, man, that guy gave me a heart attack. Jesus. You scared the bejesus out of me, you frick. Can I not? Oh, because we were behind a, a wall. I'm just looking for keepers, bros. Where's Rex? Oh, Rex is going. Rex is... is... Is that assassinate? What is that? Yep. Dude! Stay down, man! Jesus Christ! I'll say we just took them all out, but that Krogan would not die. Damn, man, the the dude's regeneration was uh Warehouse worker. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. I just killed 50 bodyguards to get in here. What do you think I'll do to you? Uh, well, uh, uh, screw Fist. He doesn't pay us enough for this. It would have been quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. Yeah. Begin manual override. Whoa. Okay. Take all. Um, and yeah, Avenger too. Just a straight upgrade. Sick. Don't think we got anything for him. We didn't. I mean, we got a new pistol, but people aren't really using pistols. Yeah. Oh, that's the dude. Can I take cover now? Is that a is that a thing we can do? Oh shit! I wanted to hide behind the sofa. Uh, just just last safe. It's probably just before the den, I think. Where the hell are we? Yes! Just before the den. That's fine. Looks like it shut down. It's a little bit janky tr Dude, will you get out of the way? Trying to use the cover system is uh a little bit janky. Oh, right in the dick. Even the bartender's having a go, man. Huh? 
shoot him in the leg, yeah. Okay. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll take them out. Oh shit. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I tried to skip the uh Anyway, well, we didn't get the two renegade points, but I'm not overly, uh, not overly worried about that. Dude, we got different stuff. We got different stuff. Um, and we didn't get a direct upgrade in assault rifle, <laughs> which is kind of scummy, but okay. I surrender. I need information. Where's the Quarian? She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here. Said she'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting. I don't know where she is. Except for I know exactly where she is. It's basically what he's just said, like... Give me the location. Now. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make See? You hurry. He knows exactly where she is. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. Yeah, he deserved it. A lot it. of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's move. We have to save that Quarian. Yeah. There we go. Take hey, all. Cool. We'll check those out shortly. Can't get that one. Oh, there's a lot of dudes. Get out of the way, you fool. Damn, man, this guy is, uh, he's cool, but damn, does he get in the way or what? He's gonna poke his head up, or, oh shit, there's another guy. Hello. Oh shit. <laughs> It's as if he knew. Dude, where are we even going? Uh... Get to the alley. The alley's up here. And that's where it's going down. Did you bring it? Where's the Shadow Broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Oh, 
Oh shit! You just pants stuck to there and I wanted to. I knew I couldn't trust him. Grenade and just kind of. Like, <laughs> um. Yeah, we Don't took care of him. Fist. He got what was coming to him. Then I guess there are two things I need to thank you for. Who are you? I'm a friend. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life, but not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. Okay. Oh, it's just going to take us there. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards and all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? You wanted proof Saren's a traitor. This is it. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, miss. My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars. Only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. Dun, dun, dun. This proves he was involved in the attack. What's the conduit? He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished! At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. That's not far-fetched. vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. Will they believe this it? This is a lot to handle. They might just ignore everything we tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audio files prove Saren's a traitor! The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. 
You know what I can do. Let me come. I'll be honest, you. I didn't see anything that she did because I was too busy using my manky grenade hand to be like, ah, 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 fucking grenades going like, hey, it's. I was too busy nearly blowing myself up to see what she did. Uh, what about your quest? I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Why is the top of your head so flat? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. Yeah, all right. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. She got like double knee joints. All of them have got double knee joints. So in Mass Effect, that is how you differentiate an alien. Although she's an alien, but she's a humanoid. Look, she got regular human feet. We got human feet, human feet, human feet. Double knee joint, double knee joint, double knee joint. They're like cats. Oh, she is like non-assault, but all tech. What are we? We are tech. I mean, it's gonna be a. T I got it. We don't have bio. Can bring Caden. So she's gonna be like full bio then. I don't remember. I think we're gonna stick with Garrus. I. She seems cool. But oh, we'll stick with Garrus for now. Yeah, we'll use Rex and Garrus. For now. We might swap out. We'll see. We might do it. We might swap them out. So now we're back at CSEC. There was someone to talk to. Well, we're not quite back at CSEC. CSEC's down here. There was someone to talk to. That little Volus guy. Jareed or something. Samesh Bhatia. Excuse me, Commander Bhatia. Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh Bhatia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. What do you need? Where's that name from? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Oh, Park. that dude's I wife was going to be the chef. My wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. Okay. I'll find we'll out. look into it. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral. And the respect she deserves. In the bar? What bar? Oh, the Embassy Lounge. Well, I was going this way anyway, because I was going the wrong way to CSEC again, so... Did we find all the keepers here? A diplomat? There was a keeper down there that we scanned. I'm not going to spend hours running around looking for all the keepers. I, uh... Think we'll come back to the Citadel? I, th I think we can come back. So maybe we'll try. There was a keeper out here that we scanned. Nasana, why have you got a name? I don't have time to talk now. I'm very busy. Okay. Clerk Bosca. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Yes. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? I'm here on behalf of Samesh Bhatia for his wife, Nirali. Serviceman Nirali Bhatia died on Eden Prime. As Mr. Bhatia no doubt told you. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. You're running tests. You're studying her injuries to learn more about Geth weaponry. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, serviceman Bhatia may save more lives in death than she did in life. How long do you think the research is going to take? This is a long-term study. I wouldn't expect the bodies to be released for a year or longer. 
You've got to have a lot of bodies. Can't you release one? Very few bodies had this new type of weapon damage, and very few were in good enough condition to study. I mean... Beyond that, Commander, we need as many bodies as we can to get a reasonable sample size. When will this research result in actual new technology? If we're lucky, we'll actually realize usable technology from this study in a few years. I'll pass it I'll on. I'll Mr. Bacci about this. It might make it easier for him to understand. Thank you, I appreciate that. Please let me know if you have any other questions. Surely. I mean, if it was my wife, and, and she was gonna, you know, help save countless lives, and it, it just meant I had to wait a little while to, uh, to get the body out it. The greater good, you know. Hello. I think that's what his wife would Has want. Has any progress been made with Mr. Bosco? Will you return my wife's body? Tell me again what you've been told about your wife. As I said, I've been told nothing. I don't understand why they won't release her body to me. Where can I find this, Mr. Oh, no, we already know it that. It was in the expensive bar over there. They're running medical studies on Norelli. That's why they won't release the body. Tests? They're holding my wife's body for tests? My wife served the Alliance faithfully. She gave her life for humanity. And this is how they repay her. This is war! Um. It's unacceptable. I'll let you know what I can do. Not a, not a lot. Please let me know what can be done. Hello, Commander. Has any progress been made with Mr. Bosco? There's a, there's a problem. Will you return my wife's one. body? It's not as simple as I'd hoped. The military needs your wife's body for important tests. Yes, you told me as much. I don't care what the military wants for her. My wife finished her service when she gave her life on Eden Prime. It is time for her to come home. I mean... No, this is war, man. I think... Tamesh, right now more people are going to die unless the military runs those tests. This isn't about them. This is about my wife. The woman the military killed. The military the didn't kill her. killed your wife. And they'll kill a lot more if we don't run those tests. You think I've not given enough? Don't speak to me of duty. My wife is dead. I just want her to come home. I miss her so much. Dude, she's dead. Let them run their tests. Let my wife save lives so that others are spared the loss I feel today. Goodbye. Thank you for finding me answers. They changed his mind pretty quick there, but... Like, she dead, dude. Whoa, plus nine, Renegade. Oh, dear. <laughs> if we got any spare points, we might go into Charm, because I don't want to be, like, full Renegade, and at the minute... We're getting quite a bit of Renegade. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> um, we're going to go up to Master Electronics. Uh, Master Overload. Pretty much straight away. i got to remember to level up the other dudes too. You're just going to go up to an agent, I think. Because he's not going to use sniper rifles, so... Probably won't level that up for a little while. Probably go up to medium armor next. And... Rex is using shotguns. So we're going to unlock fitness. And then we're going to go in some shotguns. There we go. The, the dude's gone. Hey, dude. Good to see you. How are you? We are currently trying to find all the keepers. <laughs> 